An act of violence against a Roanoke City school bus carrying students. Roanoke police say a school bus was damaged during a shooting this afternoon while taking students home from after school activities. But officials say no one was hurt. 10 News reporter Sydney Jacks Timer is working for you tonight to explain what we know about this incident and how school leaders are responding. Just minutes after survey results about gangs and violence were presented to the Roanoke City School Board, the meeting was interrupted by news of shots being fired at a Roanoke school bus that was carrying students home from James Madison Middle School. I do need to step out so that I can get the details and we can talk to everyone involved just to make sure that everybody is okay. Superintendent Verlita White and other administrators left the board meeting and rushed to the scene. Officials say five students were on board the bus when a bullet struck the front tire. No injuries have been reported. Our school bus driver, Ms. Marjorie, she's a hero today. And uh, she stayed calm, she kept our students calm, and she was able to navigate that bus in a way that she didn't have an accident. Superintendent White says this incident is very concerning and upsetting. She's calling on the community to come together to keep one another safe especially children. This is not um, a school issue, but it's a community issue for all of us to make sure that we're doing everything that we can to make sure that these kinds of things don't happen in our city or even around our schools and our students. School officials say there will be counseling services available for students. Police say no arrests have been made. If you have information about the incident, you're encouraged to call police. You can do so anonymously. In Roanoke, Sydney Jacks Timer 10 News, working for you.